Now I'm gonna pull out all the stops and make a batch of sticky buns. I'm gonna start by making the topping for the sticky buns. I've got a whole pound of butter in the mixer and I'm gonna add three cups of packed brown sugar, a good pinch of salt, and for stickiness, a quarter cup of honey. Now to this mixture in the mixer, I'm gonna add some whiskey and some vanilla. I'm gonna sprinkle a bunch of chopped pecans in the bottom of a buttered skillet. This entire mixture is gonna go over the pecans. This pan goes into the oven. It's gonna bake at 325 for about 10 to 15 minutes. In the meantime, I'll walk you through how to make the dough. I poured a couple of cups of milk into a pan with half a cup of vegetable oil, half a cup of sugar, then turned the heat on, and just before it came to a boil, I turned the heat back off. When it was cooled to almost lukewarm, I sprinkled over a packet of active dry yeast, and after a minute, I added four cups of all-purpose flour, mixed it in, covered it with a tea towel and left it for an hour. After that time, I added half a teaspoon of baking powder, the same amount of baking soda, the same amount of salt, half a cup of all-purpose flour, stirred it in, transferred it to a clean bowl, then covered the dough and got it in the fridge. This has been in the fridge, so it's really easy to work with. I got the dough all rolled out, and I'm gonna pour melted butter all over the surface. Okay, I'll get a cup of sugar, a little container of cinnamon. So I'll start at this end, and I've gotta roll them up. Slice them into rolls. The rolls go right on the melted topping, then they rise for 20 minutes, and go into a 325 degree oven for 30 minutes. Flip the rolls so that all the sticky stuff is on top. Oh, wow, look at that. They could not have turned out any better.